Hello and welcome back to the Audacious Altmer. Before we get started, I would like to just address something that people have been bringing up, which is why are we no longer all about Shia Gorath? What happened? What's the deal with that? Oh, I also just noticed that his thing has disappeared off there. Is that because I reloaded the game or did that happen like episodes ago? I have no idea. Anyway, um, basically the reason why we're no longer going all in on Shia Gorath is kind of twofold. One, we're a new character. We've got new ambitions. This is, is a completely fresh start for our character. The old character, all about the Shia Grath, a cultist. We got kind of what that was about. We got general a little bit into it. And we generally kind of set things up a little bit. But, there, you know, there was only one way that could go. The only extra thing we needed to do there was reveal ourselves and then see where that takes us. We've got a new character, we've got a chance to do new weird things, and, well, I want to join a different guild, see how that goes. I just basically want to experience what's going on in the mod, there's a whole bunch of different options. The second thing is that uh, some people were saying that they weren't really liking that direction, which was fair. So I felt it kind of works in two, two different ways, so let me know what you think. Anyway, we're going to unpause, uh, continue being in our new guild. Are we fabricating claims on anything? We are, in which case there's absolutely nothing to do. Yep. That's fine, invite to plot. Yeah, sure, I want an artifact stolen from him. Seems fair enough. We are acting against our leash still a little bit. Uh, lo lately my guild assignments have uh, got my new cat friend, so you know what? Sure, sounds good. Yeah, we'll be friends with a cat. We inherited Deer Hollow. That's nice. Uh, we got a new Aeliad sword there. Nice. Uh, okay. Sorry, I've just been playing a different mod, so... Uh, Switching back and forth between uh, mods, everything's a little bit different. The other mod had that over there. It's, anyway, whatever. A uh, fine elven blade crafted in the pattern of the elf warriors once of Cyrodiil. Of uh, the wild elf. Uh, let me try again. I didn't say warriors at all. A fine elven blade crafted in the pattern of the wild elves once of Cyrodiil. In their time, they were the foremost enchanters of Tamriel and their weapons were built to match. Capable of holding a sharp edge and a deadly enchantment both. So it gives us... Plus one martial, plus two learning, plus three personal combat. That's pretty cool. Personal combat's changing in the uh, new uh, DLC that's coming out. They're making it a sixth stat, which is pretty crazy at this point in the game's life cycle. Um, why is Vessel on where- oh, it's just been sieged. I was like, why is it worth nothing? It's fine. We'll hold on to that extra province. Uh, again, it's we're losing 20% tax, but that is, well... That is more than 20% of our uh, income, right? Maybe. It is close. But basically, I think it's worth holding on to just for just now. I have no real reason to get rid of it. We're now known as the Fist. Okay, that's a little bit of a weird nickname, I'd say. Ooh, chance we... 2% chance we gain Marshall. We didn't get it. Okay, well, that's fine. Okay, but yeah, the Fist. Have we done anything Fist-like? Oh, I suppose we are, um... The... Oh no, I thought we were the marshal of our liege, but we're not, so yeah, I have no idea. Oh, we've become stressed. No matter how many issues you deal with, there are more demanding your attention. Yep, know the feeling. There's a trade route. We can spend 300 to keep it going. Uh, I say we think it's too expensive. That'll lower the amount we're making from it, right? Uh, okay, so everything is going well for musical performance, heart-wrenching ballad. Everyone likes it. We get some gold. Great. I just want to see how much we're making from Deer Hollow and whether it goes down. It, losing the trade route, route doesn't really appear to have lost us any money. Upon conclusion of a long council meeting, you decide to make a toast. Of course, one toast eventually becomes many, and time seems to slip away. Later, as you leave the council chambers, you stumble and fall on your face, and you feel a taste of blood in your mouth and dizziness setting in. Well, you know what? I don't think we're going to draw attention to ourselves. That's fine. Yeah, didn't even get wounded. Day after day spent training and nights after night poring over treaties, tomes, and manuals is finally paying off. I'm ready to take the next step in my studies and receive formal recognition for my abilities and one of my declared specializations. Uh, yes. All Nurn is a stage, and I am one of its finest players. I am a bard. Great. We get diplomacy, we get intrigue, we lose some stewardship, general opinion goes up, everyone likes bard. Great. Uh, it looks like um, our liege might win against the civil war that's going on, which is interesting. Uh, Rahiba was introduced by a mutual friend. We talked for a while while we had our differences and a few arguments. We then found common safe ground and began enjoying myself. Yeah, sure, we'll be friends. That sounds good. Assuming that we want to have more cat friends. 
Ooh, more places to convert into my religion, which is nice. Also, another thing about the Shia Gorath cult, now that we've created it, I want to see where that leads. I want to see it, it appear suddenly out of nowhere and just completely jump out at us. I think that could be fun. But, you know, we'll see. See how good the AI is at leading their own uh, cults. Right. Now, it does look like we should give away Vesselon, look, look at the numbers, but I don't think that's right because it is looted. So we need to give away these three because we did lose an extra domain there uh, because we lost the stewardship. It's unfortunate. Um, right. Let's have a look. Ooh. Are those uh, Draugr? Effectively, yeah. Okay. Oh, no, Dragon Cult. Oh, all right. Um, well, I want to search um. Let's search all for will join court. Um, pure. And with, I don't know. Let's go with pure chip for the first one. We'll get one of each. Get the highest diplomacy. Make sure they're pure and not impure. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Invite the highest diplomacy. The highest marshal. Uh, invite to court. Highest stewardship. This one. The highest intrigue. And the highest learning. Also a necromancer. Interesting. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Six. Five. Six. Did I invite six? I thought I only invited five. Oh, do we have magic now? We do. Oh, maybe that's because we're bard and bard act gives you access to magic. Maybe it's magician, but I think it's bard looking at the amount of magic we actually have. Okay, court. Um, we have a prisoner? Yeah. Okay, search my court for any. Obviously, they can't join your court when they're in your court. Just start giving out titles. So you can have uh, Silverwood. Um, ooh, what's that one? Cult of a Vermina. Interesting. Marshal. We have a 31 Marshal. That's amazing. He is a commander, right? Yeah, now, do we want to lose his amazing commander skills for his martial skills? Not really. Um, okay. Well, I'm going to give the new person I invited the land. Ebon Stadmont. And then stewardship. You can have Deer Hollow. Right, good. Okay, a few bits of land are getting sieged. Not an issue. Uh, is money still coming in? Eh, not very quickly, but it's still coming in. It's alright. I was going to say, oh, didn't we have somebody building in Rosefield? Nope, that was a scam. We were scammed, so not really going to work out. Uh, I find it curious that the Riddle Thar priests are constantly pestering Cole Dargo no matter what he promises to do or no matter how much money he bestows to the Riddle Char Church. Um, I know what he can do. Well, propose a solution. We got an advancement. We can go legalism, which gets us no bonuses right now. Oh no, it would. This is um, medium centralization and religious control mandate if we wanted it. Tolerance, don't really need that. You know what, let's grab it. Let's grab an extra level of legalism. Anything else that we need? Um, what's our main army type? It is heavy infantry. I'm gonna disband it anyway. But uh, heavy infantry here. Grab that. Let's make him a little bit better. That seems generally okay. Town infrastructure probably isn't needed. We don't have any cities. Yeah. Okay. Unpause. Let things go. Musical entertainment. Yeah. Heart wrenching ballad. We have a plan. We'll keep doing it. Worked again. Fantastic. Some more money. Goals have been breeding in Duskwood. Well, there goes our money. Hire some fighters. Alexia has uh, got rid of the trolls, and we have paid our money out. Right. Three characters still owe us a favor. Yeah, I need to figure out what to do with those. Like, there, there's potential there. It's just how we actually get that to work. Mostly, it's got to be around changing laws, but right now we're, we're fairly happy with how things are going. Everything's going in the right direction. It's just slow. Okay. Oh, he thinks we have the flu. Uh, and he's given us soft, easy to digest foods um, to see whether that gets rid of it. It did not. We also have a fever. 
He now thinks we have pneumonia. Okay. Uh, he's given us the, uh, the, a handful of hawk feathers and instructed us to chew one before and after each meal. The raw feathers of dead bird are among the best thing for curing diseases, he noted. Ironic, isn't it? Mm, I don't think that works. Ah, we have the flu. He was right the first time. Okay. So, how are we going to get rid of it? Suppose we get a potion? Yeah. Get a little potion. Uh, one cure disease, freshly brewed and ready to drink. Maybe a while before it takes full effect, but you should be fine sooner or later. Good. That's what I like to see. Uh, we have troublesome peasants, and then the realm is back together. Nice. Um, our leash dislikes us. Why does he dislike us? Attraction to flu. He dislikes us because he doesn't like that uh, we have the flu. Really? Minus 30 for that. That's a little bit extreme, isn't it? Oh no, this person has the flu. I can't talk to them ever. Awful. We have more slow to have appeared in our land, which is unfortunate, because there's not a lot we can really do about it. My waist is growing bigger. So is my appetite. Um... You know what? We'll try and hold off. Try and be temperate. We did, begin, we did get temperate. Nice. Our health went down, but our stewardship went up. That's good. Okay. Oh, we can rank up in our society. That makes us a chronicler. Nice. More general opinion. Grab that. We have lost the flu. Honor journeyman tally. I hereby grant you the permission to advance to the next rank within the scenery guild. Signed, Grandmaster Caberlas. Well, thank you. Ooh, and he gave us a map of Nurn as a uh, reward there. The third book that we have equipped. Plus one diplomacy, plus one stewardship. I just noticed uh, Highland Cavi. A corpulent fuzzy rodent that spends much of its time uh, gorging itself on hay and vegetables. Cavies tend to be extremely docile, and this one is no exception. It curls up next to its owner and squeaks contentedly when petted. I think that is better than the scamp right now. I'm going to equip it. Our vassals really like us because we have a little cute pet. Great. Right. There's a magnificent painting, which is just general. Okay, we don't have to equip that. That's fine. Apanurin is very good. Yeah. Uh, yes, we've been offered the singer job again. Once again, we've got our pattern. We'll sing our ballad. We'll get our gold. We'll move on. Uh, we have refugees. We need to get rid of them. My friend's friend is also my friend. I'm also trying to live by, and sometimes that is an easy truth. The friend of my friend was introduced. I immediately felt a connection with this stranger. With uh, Modo Doran. Hmm. Yeah, sure. We'll be friends. That's fine. Uh, we've pa he's paid 50 gold to get rid of refugees. I don't know when I started disliking Mododoran, but it must have been when he disagreed with me about how peasants should be treated. The more we talked, the less I liked him, and enough was enough. We could never be friends, only rivals. I don't like you, I don't like you at all, Mod Mododoran. Okay. Well, we have another one to potentially have a look at here. Can't kill him, can't kidnap him. The previous person who wants to kill and kidnap also cannot get. That's fine. We will hold off. Generally, things are going all right. Um, do we have enough magicka to summon a... Um, no, we don't have enough magicka to summon anything. So we could get some and uh, fight off the slowed. That's okay. Inherited the barony of Eldara. Uh, which we can hold on to because we actually have enough stewardship. We do, however, need a new steward. Who can be uh, this guy? This gal? Fine. Make some money. Uh, disband the troops. Oh, those are event spawn troops. Oh, keep them then. Seems alright. Laying waste to first hold castle and first hold wasn't enough for the underhanded treat thane uh, to treat hane uh, Ladras. Ladras? Yeah, but he stole one of my prized possessions. He stole my magnificent painting. Oh no. How dare he just not on at all, really. My magnificent painting. Peasant accused of murder is dragged before your court. His wife and children were found butchered in the small hut they called home, and he was standing nearby, covered in her blood. Despite this damning evidence, the man continues to profess his innocence. What should be done with him? He should be hanged. Obviously. Yeah. Don't see why we need a second option there. 
Uh, how's the magic looking? 15. How much do we need for troops? We probably need a little bit more, don't we? Uh, can we even open our spell book? Wait. We should, we should have the ability to open a spell book, shouldn't we? Hm. I guess not. Okay, so we have magicka, but we can't actually do any spells? Am I blind, or... Maybe? Hmm. Okay. That's unfortunate. Magic without the ability to use magic is really a bit pointless, isn't it? Yeah, so I select here. Yeah, we just have we have magicka, but no ability to use magicka. Uh, your chief just this year, Baron Gillian of Thorheim, has put forward a plan of experimentation uh, with new military technology inspired by a supposedly brilliant inventor and engineer that you recently befriended. All he needs is a little funding. All right, well, you know, I'm made of money, so here you go. We are about to lose Riverwatch. It's unfortunate. Screaming Arrows. You have received a report on the outcome of the military experiments that your chief just this year and asked you to sponsor. Apparently, a new kind of self-propelled arrow... Oh, just this year is Marshall, so we are Marshall for our liege. And that, the nickname The Fist does make sense. All this clicked into place. Apparently, a new kind of self-propelled arrow was tried out based on Far Eastern models. Lit by fire, these arrows would scream and fly away, leaving a trail of smoke, and then explode on impact, killing several of livestock used as practice targets. Though of dubious accuracy and prone to failure in rainy weather, these experiments have still provided some viable lessons. Excellent. Yes, that seems really quite good. No nope, chest pains. Okay, um, he thinks it's not a serious illness and it'll pass soon. But he then gave us some mushroom. Hmm. Nice. Okay. Uh, the chest pains you've been experiencing lately seem to have stopped. He was right, it was just nothing, nothing important. It's fine. As I retired to my chambers, I was shocked to find a copy of the Cult of Shiagorath's Accord of Madness. No, get rid of it. Get rid of it. With some of my free time at the guild hall, I thought it would be a fine idea to do some painting. What a wonderful painting it is. I'm rather amazed with how well I captured the verdant greens of the rolling landscape and the delicate blue hue of the afternoon sky. I simply must find something to do with the painting. And keep it for myself. Donate it to my guild hall. Give it to my um, husband or sell it. I'm going to give it to my husband. See how he likes my painting. Ah, oh, he hasn't told me anything yet. He must hate it. Right, request council support. Uh, sure, I'll give you that council support you're after. There is a bit of disease all over the place. Oh, we do need to shut the gates. That really quickly spread into our land. Okay, River Watch is something we could potentially take back right now. Um, yes, yeah, so what disease is it? It's Swamp Rot. Okay. Well, River Watch, we can just declare on, right? I didn't mean to set my special interest. Yeah, we can just do a conquest. He only has 700 men. We have 800 men. Possible. Possible for us to do it. Mm. I think I'm going to declare war. Right. Uh, raise up all of the men that we can. Get them all merging up uh, over here. See how it goes. Did lose 50 of them. So that's a large army up there. We can ignore. Okay, we got some. We definitely got some who are joining us. Then they got another 400 coming on their side. We're at 1,000. I must have miscounted. I, I didn't count the 250 we had, I think, is where my mistake was. We can attack in here. We have no leaders because the gates are shut. Swamp Rot. Well, we're not going to die, so I'll just open the gates and kill them. Right, uh, make sure we have three leaders. Or 31. 22. 16. Could be a nice easy win for us. Wasn't. Alright, attack in here. Right. There we go. Absolutely destroy them. They decided to go for a weird left-only flank. A little bit of an odd strategy. No longer stressed. Maybe slightly swamp rotted, but not stressed. Yeah, I'll go sing. Another uh, heart-wrenching ballad. Ooh, more people liked it. Great. Uh, Levy situation in first hold is not entirely hopeless, but close enough. I'll do my best to revive the situation. Hopefully my leash will see some results soon. As long as nobody meddles with my plans. A local noble is going to meddle, though. 
Salt that down, 100%. Offer peace and enforce our demands. Riverwatch is back to being ours. And I am going to end the episode here. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.